Search for lost family members is over in Middle Tennessee following the deadly tornadoes that struck there. All the people have been found, but David Winter joins us live from Cookville with the search for pets. David. Paula Kyle, this is Echo Valley Estates. It is looking so much like the rest of this county that was hit so hard by the tornadoes. And while the people here are working hard to climb out of all of this destruction and despair, they're now turning their focus after lo losing their family members to finding their other family members, their pets, their dogs and their cats. Take a look at this video that we shot a short while ago. Joyce Wilson, her daughter is holding Tennessee Tucker, a four month old beagle who was trapped for 48 hours underneath the top floor of his home. Miraculously, he was found unhurt as the search for more lost pets continues. The Cookville Putnam County Animal Shelter has a binder full of lost cats and dogs. They also have several pets that have turned, uh, have been turned in that can't find their people. For the LeClairs, finding Tucker was a godsend. Outside of us kids, that's all she wanted to know is where's Tucker, where's Tucker? And she was um, very depressed and in pain. And once we found him, the nurses said, uh, we're willing to look the other way if you want to bring him in. It wasn't even dented. And there he was. Well, take a look at this. This is the actual kennel that Tennessee Tucker was found in. He had lasted 24, excuse me, 48 hours underneath the top floor of this home. It is absolutely a miracle. Perhaps the LeClairs need to rename Tennessee Tucker to Tucker the Wonder Dog. Reporting live from Tennessee, back to you. Yeah, David, it does my heart good. And animals will do that. They'll hunker down in a small space and they'll stay quiet for a long time. So you have to search. Are you hearing about shelters there being overwhelmed in any way or pets coming up to the tri-state because they need help? Yeah, I haven't heard about them being overwhelmed, but they definitely do at this shelter have quite a few dogs that are being attended to. Unfortunately, some of the people can't be found, uh, not because they don't know who they are, but so many of them have lost their cell phones and don't know that their animals have been found. It's really, really tragic, but at least in this case, uplifting story that's come out of this tornado. Yeah, I hope to hear more. Thank you, David. On Tuesday, March 10th, join Local 12 as we come together to help those affected by the deadly Tennessee tornadoes. You can donate to the Salvation Army Sinclair Cares Stand with Nashville Relief Fund, and we'll have a link at local12.com.